Hey guys, so this is a quick look at a custom Alita Battle Angel head sculpt that I bought off eBay. So I bought two of them, they come unpainted, and I just want to talk about some sort of tips and little things that I worked out after painting two of them. So first off, thin your paints, that would be the main thing. Um, the, the, as watery as possible without being like watercolour. Um, and do lots of the, th the finest layers you can, nice and smooth. You don't want the paint to be too thick. You can see it's a little, not too bad on this one. Um, another thing would be to not do too many layers, because again, that gets too thick, you lose the detail. Um, take your time for starters, so also get the thinnest paintbrush possible so that you can do all the nice little fine details. Her eyes were especially difficult. Luckily, she's got quite big eyes. But you can see here, the one on the right is my first attempt. And I don't know if the camera's picking it up, but the paint looks sort of thick, almost like you've, like, paper mache. Um, it's, I think it still looks okay. I definitely like the first one. Um, I'm pretty happy with that. But again, I was just too thick with the paint, and it just lost a lot of detail. Although, on camera, not too bad. Anyway, these head sculpts are really awesome. Um, they were, I can't remember the price of them, they weren't too bad. They're the only head sculpts in the one six, sorry, one twelfth scale. Um, highly recommend, if you've not done a lot of head sculpt, you know, head painting before, buy a couple. Because after I did this one, I was pretty fucked off with it. You can see the paint just doesn't have a nice, the skin doesn't have a nice smooth look. Whereas this one, a lot smoother. And the eyes, a lot nicer. But, you know, it's just a learning thing. It's just practice. By no means am I a professional painter. I think these are... I'm, I'm pleased with the one on the right. Like, I'm very happy with it. Um, but comment below. Tell me if you've got any tips. Do you seal yours with any, like, clear coat? Because I haven't put any clear coat on mine. And I'm not sure what body to stick it on because um, I, yeah, just not sure which Alita body, what type of body would be good for an Alita figure. But uh, yeah, so again, thin your paints, use the smallest possible paintbrush and take your time. There's no point rushing this. Um, I know it's fun to like get it done so you've got this head sculpt, but just be nice and slow, nice thin layers, water, you know, water the paints down. Um, you just want that nice finish on the skin because you, you will see it. Like this this one's not perfect, but it's a lot better and in hand, not that noticeable. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching and I'll see you guys on the next video.